Morning! It's the 11th of January 2023, got Long John here. Ow! Uh, today, John, ambulance drivers. Ah, on circle. Ambulance then. stuff, so big up to them. They don't big deserve up. a right. Well, Come on, lads. Everybody deserves a right. Uh, you know, school teachers dead on the back, we're on strike. And oh, well, Jonathan Gullis. Ah. He's the MP for Stoke on Saint North. Ah. I don't know why they voted for him. I, I look at him and I think... That's how, nobody else put up a bit. I look at him and I think, how did he get in the parliament? There's no one of this country in a fucking mess. I swear. I'm trying not to swear, yeah. Try not to swear. And he stood up in parliament yesterday and he said they were an ex-teacher and an ex-uni member and a, and a rep for NASUWT, the teachers' union. And he said the striking teachers are commies and Bolsheviks. <laughs> <laughs> Bolsheviks. Who uses that term now? Yeah. And he said they are deliberately, de deliberately making kids suffer. Yeah. So I had a look, and then he voted against. That's his mind, right? He, he voted against giving kids free school meals. So what's that if he's not suffering, Johnny? It's the, he voted. And let me tell you this, John: what? it's the Tories who are making kids suffer. Ah, it is a, Does that know? Before they came to power in 2010, there were two, 2.6 million kids. Living in pover, pover, poverty in this country, they've been in power 12 years, and we've now got three million nine hundred thousand in poverty. So they've not done nothing to help the children. So no. when he's coming on about uh, making kids suffer, there's no fucking makes kids suffer more than Tories. In fact, they make everybody suffer, including me and the John. Uh -huh. And. Uh, there's a way around it, just get teachers a 10% pay rise, nobody will be suffering then. I mean, that's how simple it is. Yeah. And uh, what I need to know, I need somebody from Stoke Consent now to come on and tell me what he offered to people at Stoke Consent, what he's actually done for them, and do you think he'll get in next time? Because I don't think he's got a prayer. I can't believe that they're standing up and preaching all this shit when they've just fetched this bloody thing out where it tells you what they're earning and oh, right, oh, yeah, on the second yeah, jobs yeah, and that. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. So, it's hypocrite. They're hypocrites. That's what they are, Johnny. They can't manage on each 5,000, but they want me to manage on 35. Ah, That's yeah. how it works. Yeah. Anyway, Jonathan Gullies, he's heading for oblivion still after the next election. I can't wear a single crashing down to bold, the bottom. They are going bold, John. Wakey, wakey! <laughs>